This video is your five minute mobility routine to help you loosen up and stay mobile during these times when you might be more sedentary than normal. For all the people on my four week forward membership, you would have seen this routine before, but for everyone else, enjoy. Okay, to start, you need yourself one of these or a broom because uh, this is gonna be our workout base for today. Because I'm in the gym, I don't need this. I'm gonna use this instead. But they act in exactly the same way. So to start, we're gonna take our broom handle and put it on your shoulders. So just rest in on your shoulder blades. This is gonna be our start position. So to start with nice and loose, I'm just gonna rotate in either direction. Let everything rotate. And now what we're going to do is isolate the hips. So at all times my hips are going to stay facing you and I'm going to rotate from the spine. Range is reduced, but that doesn't matter. We don't need to rush this exercise. And now what we're going to do is elbow is going to drop down the side of your ribs. And now we're going to go into a shoulder press to loosen up the shoulders. If you've got any shoulder issues, avoid this exercise and move on to the next one. So we're going to start, so again they're resting on your shoulders and the bar is going to go above your head. So what we're going to do is the bar goes behind the back of your head rather than your head move forward. I'll show you from side on. So here rather than here. So I have to go behind. If you find that easy, narrow your hands. And try and do the same movement. And now we're going to drop into a squat. So feet slightly turned out, shoulder widths apart, elbows pushed forwards. So I'll show you what it looks like. And then we're gonna squat down to your own depth. And then stand up again. Squeeze your glutes tight at the top. Try and make sure your heels don't come off the ground and you don't bend too far forward. Try and stay proud in the chest. And now, we're gonna combine that with the shoulder press. If that's too difficult, do the shoulder press at the top of the range. Okay, now it's here where it gets complicated. Now take the bar and put it down your back. So it touches your hip, the middle of your back, and the back of your head. It stays in contact at all points, and you're gonna hinge at the hip. If you lose contact, don't go any lower. Just try and work on your posture. We're going to try and do that movement now, but with a bar in your hands. So when you go down to the bottom position at this time, you're going to lift up your arms straight. Try and keep your arms straight if you can. I'll show you from the front. Okay, even more complicated. Left hand, bar goes on the outside of left hand, and you're gonna hold on and then twist the bar inwards. And 
now switch. Right arm, outside of right arm, hold on, twist inwards. Now, we put the bar on the floor about a meter or just less in front of you. Hand straight, gonna hinge forward at the hip again and rotate in either direction. As you can see, I'm just softening either knee as I rotate. And that is your mini mobility workout at home. Thank you for watching that video. Uh, I really hope it helped. Check out the other videos that we've got. And again, as I said, if you're on my UCLH, check out the other links to resources that we've got. And if you've got any other ideas of content that you'd like us to produce with regard to helping your health and well-being, please let me know and uh, stay well.